Good morning, dear friends. This is such a beautiful Saturday morning. So we will have a tour of our backyard. Let's see the flower, how it looks. Looks this way from bottom to see it. And uh, I want to show you something marigold and ne m'oublie pas, forget me not. Rose, yellow rose, and uh, <coughs> this is already coming to the end. Orange and uh, <clears throat> we have one perfect kala lily, so perfect. And the blueberry is coming up, we have quite some blueberry ready to pick up. See, three huge jumbo blueberry, and we have little tomatoes coming up. I saw it somewhere. Give me some time to look for it. Yes, little tomatoes coming up. Raspberry, and we have one golden raspberry coming up. And we have <coughs> red raspberry ready to pick up. Perfect. And some more tomatoes. We have three tomato plants this time. And this one is... Um, <coughs> Cherry red tomato. Oh, another raspberry. They look so good. And this one is a super jumbo one. It's called Lemon Boy. And this one is a small one, heirloom. Heirloom is usually small. <coughs> so <coughs> the the um, this is a fig, and fig tree is coming out twice a year. No, the fruit comes out twice a year. There are two productions to harvest so this is the second one and the first one you can see some out there already coming up big and this will be will be ready in the autumn season I think another oh yeah the same golden raspberry The herbs are doing very well. Look at the flower. This, this must be this is um, <clears throat> um, lavender, lavender, lavande. I think I forgot which brand we bought or which kind we bought. It's a, it's a, it's a very fragrant lavender. And here you, 
your hand put into this herbs garden and all your hand will be so good so smells so good and fresh and um, this one is um, um, romarin rosemary every time i touch it my hands is full of uh, romarin and this one i think is oregano this one is oregano oregano and parsley how good is this parsley look at it so good and this one is the thyme and oregano thyme and olive is here i'm not sure if we can see the olive it's the flower and I don't know where is the, the, the olive produce and these this should be plum or something I forgot this might be another framboise look at the shape of the leaf looks like raspberry not much produce here but a perfect flower rose <clears throat> this is so perfect with some red inside and this flower it's crawling or bush rose I think this is a rose but uh, winter time it was so cold so I think it, it uh, passed out Bed. And we have some, um, <coughs> we have some beautiful. Uh, oh, this is uh, um, lavender, as I remember. This one is lavender. It must be. Yeah, smells lavender. Mm. Yeah. Put your hand here and you can smell the can make into pillows and make a flower bag fragrance bag lavender and this one is a, a color lily a kind of lily not sure which kind of color lily actually in color lily there are many kinds also and uh, <coughs> rose Oh no, um, peony. Peony is, it means a lot, a lot, a lot for me because uh, my mother does a lot, did a lot of peony painting and her painting was collected and published into book, books and, uh, and um, she was just every day painting painted peonies and she has such a beautiful, she had such a beautiful expression of peonies. We will have a lot. When you see the peony you know that painting peony <coughs> it's a, such a um, such a spiritual experience it's really not about um, what an exact shape it can be any shape you have white peony and this uh, red peony it's so wonderful look at it oh wow must be very sweet with a lot of ants Look at this peony. I will do a peony painting. So beautiful. So perfect. Layer after layer. It's uh, in the center there are some black color, white color, pink color and different layer of red color combination don't you agree we will do one